I have nothing short of an amazing, beautiful, wonderful family. And we have two amazing, wonderful kids, children, teenagers now. Jackie and Amari are my, are my beautiful children, are the extension of what is good about me, of everything that is good about me. And you parents out there understand and can relate to this. There is nothing more empowering, nothing more uh, beautiful, nothing more satisfying than watching the fruits of your labor, watching the fruits of, of your being be successful in life. But nothing comes with more challenge. Nothing comes with more uh, uh, setbacks. Nothing comes with more anxiety and stress than raising children, than being the role model and the parent and the teacher of, of a young person and helping them evolve into a grown up. There is nothing more satisfying, but also nothing more challenging than being a parent. And that starts at the very, very beginning, right? The birth of that child, the birth of our children was the beginning of pain, was the beginning of discomfort, was the beginning of anxiety, was the beginning of, of not knowing what's going to happen. You see, giving birth is an analogy, a metaphor for life. Now, I didn't give birth to our children, but I was there in the room with my wife and witnessed what a woman goes through when giving birth to another human being, to giving birth to another form of life. And so we have two children, as I said, and the first one, the first birth was filled with anxiety and stress as we sat in the, in the room for hours trying to bring our daughter into this world. And it took hours for her to go from the womb to the world. Hours to go from inside to outside. And then the life of being a parent began, but it started with anxiety, it started with pain. Now what we realize with our next child, with Amari, is that the pain of birth is inevitable. That bringing forth a new life comes with pain, comes with challenge, comes with discomfort. We realize that. So with our son, Yes, it was painful. Yes, we were still anxious, but we expected some pain because we understood that to give life, that to bring life forth, you had to go through some dirty pain. You had to go through some discomfort. You had to go through some mess. Now, your dream and your vision of the best version of you is exactly the same thing. The vision of, of what you know that you can be is exactly the same thing. That vision, that dream, that thing that you know you are, that person, that woman, that man that you know you are, that's inside your spirit is the exact same thing. And so to give birth, to the best version of you, to give birth to what's inside of you, to give birth to all that you've been wanting to be, all that you have been dreaming of doing, to give birth to that is going to require some pain. It's going to require some angst. It's going to require some discomfort. It's going to require some mess. It's going to get messy. It's going to get uncomfortable. You're going to want to cry. You're going to want to quit. You're going to want to yell, but you got to go through it to bring that vision to bear, to birth the new you, to birth the best you. Right? So I want you guys to, to, to know that. Now, once you know 
what it's going to take once you've given life to some dreams, once you've given life to some things you've wanted. You understand the process. Now, I've given life to some dreams. I gave life to my dream of playing football in college. I gave life to my dream of becoming a chief financial officer. I gave life to my dream of building a fitness brand and business. And now I'm giving life to a new me. I'm giving life to a new vision. I'm giving life to another part inside of me that has been longing to come out, that has been nurturing and developing inside of me. And now it's ready to come to bear, but it's not easy. It's not going to be easy. It won't be without pain. It won't be without discomfort. This new version of me, the version of Coach Bobby that is putting greatness into your heart, that's putting greatness into your spirit. That part of me requires some things that have been inside of me for a long time, but bringing all of that to bear, having to speak, having to be vulnerable, having to do things I'm not used to, that requires some pain. But I know that I've given birth before to my visions, to my dreams. So I understand that this anxiety, that this discomfort is part of the process. I'm giving birth to a new me. I'm giving birth to a new vision. I'm giving birth to a new evolved, better version of Coach Bobby. And I want you guys to do the exact same thing. Look around you, look inside of you at things you've already accomplished and understand that we're not gonna worry about it too much. We're not gonna run from it. Whatever's inside of you, that dream, that vision, that, that idea of what you know you can be, of what you understand in your heart that you should be. It's going to be painful. It's going to be uncomfortable. It's gonna come with some fear and doubt and anxiety and a whole lot of mess. But I want you guys to take some comfort in knowing that we are going to get through this. We are going to, to, to go through all the labor that's required. We have people around us to help us to get through this process, this journey, the labor of love, the labor that's required to bring our vision to light, to bring our vision to bear, to bring the best part of us that's inside of us out, the best part of us that's inside of us to the world, to give our vision life, to give our dream life, to give the better part of us life, right? To give birth to our dream, to give birth to our vision. It will be painful, it will be messy, but let's devote our time, let's devote our heart, and let's commit to giving birth to our dream.